I don't know who's in here with me. I see there's two and I'm one. So who are you? Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Happy Hermit. <laughs> Whew, long day. I'm just waiting for Carol Ann. I'm hoping she will um, sort out how to get in here. I sent her an email. Um, let me, I'm just making sure it's sent okay. My internet has been a little wonky with all that I'm asking of it. Um, yeah, it looks like it went to her. So she should be here shortly. I'm also going to send her a private message quickly while I talk about doing it. <laughs> How are you enjoying the conference so far? Well, now that it's over. <laughs> Yeah, I'm excited to see Jonathan too. She was, she said she was going to um, find a way to display him well. When we were practicing it, she she was holding him with a book beneath him, and he was sort of gripping onto the book. She said he's been kind of sluggish um, from I don't know for a few weeks. Uh, sorry, dry mouth, dry everything. Um, she said he's been kind of sluggish, which he sometimes does when he's preparing for a molt and he molts in a bin above ground on gravel, which is how he's done it for 44 years. So why mess with success? Um, but so she's been looking to see if he needs, if possibly he needs to molt again. <laughs> thank you thank you it's been a it's been a crazy ride i think a lot of people are still in um darcy's session do you know if she if hers completed did the video finish for darcy Oh, I have a message. Nope, that's my message to Carol. <laughs> I can delete those. I have the power. <laughs> I can do that for you. Hide people's uh, <laughs> oopsies. Oh, we got four in here now. Hi, everybody. I am, whew. <laughs> it's been a long three days. I am not someone who likes to be on camera, who is a natural, not at all. I'll shift a little so you don't see that bright tank. Um, but here we are in service of the crabs. Hi, Sherry. Oh. Thanks for the support. I have sent Carol a link. I'm not Jonathan. Sorry, Stephanie. <laughs> I'm all, I may be older than Jonathan. We don't know how old he was when he was captured, but I'm older than Jonathan is in captivity. I'll give you that. I can't wait for the finish line. At the same time, I never want it to end. I want my, if somebody else could take over and just keep it going, I would keep going, but, um, with Stacy and I having to run everything, I think uh, it's I'm ready for for us to process. Uh, we have the Zoom tonight, which um, 
Stacy has told everybody about. I don't think she set a time yet. I'm going to eat dinner at five uh, with my husband and my dog and try to decompress. So I don't think it'll be before seven. I think it's Eastern time. Um, might be six. I, Stacy's in charge of that. I'm going to let her figure that out. Oh, social media advocacy. Darn, I'd like to see that too. <laughs> so much to see. So much to see. I, I could definitely use a tutorial on social advocacy or <laughs> social media advocacy. I am going to check. You'll, you'll see me just looking around. I apologize. I'm trying to find out if Carol can find her way in. I sent her an email. Um, can't do it without her. So I'm hoping, uh, hoping she'll figure it out. Hi, Sherry, other Sherry, Sherry too. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just hoping Carol is going to uh, find her way here. I am the only one in here now. She's got an email. She's got a link in the um, private message. There's a link on the main board. Um, she might be prepping Jonathan when we were practicing. She was holding him on a book and uh, lifting the book up and he was like gripping the book as hard as he could. And she, we got some good close up footage that way. Um, if while we're waiting, you know, I'll do what I can kind of pop back and forth. <laughs> Thank you, Sherry. Not quite yet. I got all these Etsy orders to pack up, but um, that's a that's a that's a gift. I I I can do that without being filmed doing it. So it'll be a piece of cake. <laughs> um, yeah, no, it's good. It's uh, I'm ready to not be on camera. I've said that several times, but it's not my forte. But if you guys have questions about anything about the conference, somebody asked if we would do this in 2021. Probably my answer was too soon because because <laughs> I can't get I got to get through today. Um, but yes, probably it's a great platform. I have to pay by the month to hold it, which is not super cheap, um, but we'll see. And, you know, I, maybe I can sign back up. I, we have a lot to figure out uh, since we did all this in two months time. We just kind of hurtled forward and did what we could to make it work. And now we have to kind of back up and, and figure out long term uh, what we want to do. We have a, a website now, crabcon.org. Um, so you can uh, we'll keep updating that to let you know. Yay, website <laughs> to let you know what, you know, plans are in place. Um, just, you know, you all know this. I know you do, but a couple weeks it's going to take at least to, we have to download everything from the Hopin site. We should have all the talks, all the sessions, all the chats. They make all of that available. We just have to figure out the format and how to get it to the secure site, which I think is going to be Patreon. Um, and those of you who paid for full access or VIP access will have free access to the Patreon account. Those who didn't should be able to choose a la carte uh, by talk if you want. Very inexpensive. You know, I, I don't know how much, so I don't want to say an amount, but um, not much. And um, and the, or pay for you know like monthly access. We might we might consider putting up something once a month. Um, lots TBD. Yeah, here comes Stacy. Hey, come on, come on screen if you want, Stacy. I'm still waiting for Carol. 
Um, she's got links everywhere uh, that I could think to put them. Um, if anyone can think of any where else to put them, or to, if you see her, give them to her uh, in a chat. Um, it's just the, the the URL at the top of the page here. So we're just waiting for Carol and Jonathan. Um, she's excited to attend, I know. Um, <laughs> <laughs> popcorn. I am drinking water, ice water, which I've been just consuming by the bucketful for my, my voice. And just now in between Dr. Tudge's talk and this with Carolyn, uh, oh, with Carol Ann, I put about two shots of wine in there and some spritzers. So <laughs> as the talk progresses, we might get more interesting. Yes, no more talking. <laughs> uh, Stacy's going to let us know about the Zoom. I'm assuming we have time to give people um, the scoop. We have this platform until 7 p.m. I've never done this before from the organizer side, so I don't really know what happens at 7 p.m. I'm assuming it all just sort of goes dark. Uh, but if we can get that information up on the main chat before 7, we will. Um, and I think Stacy's willing to be the Zoomer in charge, the, the, the chief Zoomer in charge uh, for that. Thank you, Kelsey. Keep an eye out for Carol. Uh, Carol Ann, she, she was Carol of Crabworks years ago uh, with Vanessa and um, LHCOS in the beginning and, you know, all of, all of the different names that it was when it started out in the Yahoo group. Uh, so she thinks, so in her retirement community now, there's a lot of Carols. So she goes by Carol Ann to distinguish herself from the other Carols. And uh, she's gotten used to it, so so for our purposes, we'll call her Carol Ann. That's what she prefers now, I believe. Although she was Carol of Crabworks. Yeah, I know you haven't, Stacy. I, I, it's it's a. We will just have to figure it out. We do have a way to email all of the ticket holders through this uh, platform. So worst case scenario, we could send everyone an email probably through the hop insight, even after it, it goes down. Stacy, I think we'll, we should be able to do that. Um, so I don't still have Zoe, Abby uh, at the moment. I have two crabs that appear to be gravid, but I haven't confirmed eggs. Uh, they're just looking broody, doing the things that broody crabs do. Um, I haven't had time to, to do any of that. One is a perlatus um, who's very large. She, she was a rescue from Trisha Landers. Thank you, Trisha, if you're here, um, who I thought was a male, but uh, is not uh, if the mating was what was happening that I thought was happening. She made it with Daryl Strawberry. My uh, He's a little smaller. And uh, she's on the wheel a lot, which is also a signal for me. They're sort of migrating or, or whatever. They seem to like to do that after, before mating and after mating, before spawning especially. They're, they're all, like I'll have six crabs in the wheel a few days before spawning. They're all trying to get to the ocean, even though I tell them the ocean's right there. Um, I think it's just a biological urge. So, um, yeah, Stacy, I need a moment too. I'm going to eat at five. My husband's going to get us some takeout. Thank God. Love the man. Um, I won't be good for anything until probably six Eastern time or maybe even seven. So that's six your time, Stacy. just if that matters, you know, I don't have to be there. Just do it what you need to do. Don't worry about me, but I will try to be there. Um, I'm looking down the list, hoping Carol can find her way here. I'm just going to pop up and check my email quick and see if she replied. Um, nope, not yet. I know it's on her calendar, and I know she's been um, popping in back and forth. That's true. I do have her phone number. Let me, um, let me give her a call. 
and see. Thank you, because my brain just isn't working that way um, anymore. Jessica Guth, would you like to come on and help us troubleshoot? I just want to let you know Carol isn't here. Hey, Carol, oh. uh, Jessica, who are you? I'd like to run through the list of my kids. No, it's okay. <laughs> um, Carol isn't here. I just don't think you can see her in the chat yet. So I just wanted to hop on and let you know she's okay. here. Awesome. awesome. can't share her video. Okay. So I'm going to hop off. I just wanted the. Okay. <laughs> Thank call. you. Yeah. Um, I don't see you, Carol. Can you, at the top, there should be, if you, I'm assuming you can hear me. So at the top, there should be a um, top right where you see me, top right, should, should say enable audio and video. If you click on that, I think that will get you what you need. I shouldn't have to let you in because you're on the session. Um, I had to let Jessica in because she wasn't um, listed on the session. But hi, Carol Ann. I, I see your texts. We want to see your face, your beautiful face. <laughs> OK, good. So you clicked on the link. It got you here. We're very close. This is awesome. If you find uh, up in the top right uh, where I am, like, you know, like right there <laughs> for you, probably. Um, it is for me. I could be wrong. That should be allow audio and video or, or something along those lines. I don't remember the exact verbiage, but that should enable your, you're on your laptop with the built-in camera, correct? Carol, I'm talking to Carol. Ask to share audio and video. Thank you, Anna. That's what it should say, Carol. Well, she may not even have to ask because she's on the session, but it, it share audio and video. I think that's uh, that's what it should say. We all can't wait to see Jonathan. I haven't even seen him and I can't wait to see him again. It's in blue, Carol if that helps. Yeah, so the chat runs here, you know, where, where you're typing, where all the messages are showing up, just to the left of that and above should be that it's a button. It doesn't look like a hot link. It just looks like a blue button. Um, oh, you can see yourself. Okay, so go to, oh, are you coming? No, so go to the bottom where you see yourself. There should be a, an icon of like an old tiny um, video recorder. Click on that and see what happens. Thank you for the browser suggestion, Tammy. I'm not going to mention that yet because Carol and I did this before and I don't want to get to, here she comes. There you are. <laughs> you did it. Um, I think your audio might be off. If you look right beside where you clicked on the camera, if you click the little mic, the old timey like stage microphone, that should give you audio. Can't hear you, unfortunately. You have to somehow enable the audio, and it should be at the bottom of your screen uh, where there's those four little, um, yeah, and then the microphone. It, try clicking on that and see if that helps. Because we got it to work before. So,
it might also be the volume on your computer. I don't know if that affects. Can someone else help troubleshoot this? Stacy or Jessica, maybe, if you guys want to come on. I'm not the best. Um, you're still you're you're still silent, Carol, and I'm I'm so uh, exhausted from the past three days. I, I'm not sure. Jessica, what do you think? You think it's the so if she on the bottom of her screen clicks on the gear. Then the settings box will come up again, and then it'll say default microphone, whatever. Maybe that could be disabled, or she might have uh, something else put there. So if she can try to click default, it should try to go through without having to leave and come back in again. I would try it. Okay. And the gear thing is, it looks sort of like a sunflower or whatever. Yep, and it's going to be right at her center. Um, I guess, oh, I don't know how her screen is, but for me, it's right around here. Yeah. Hmm. I can't do it for her here. We can't hear you, Carol. Do you see a gear? Stacy's coming. She's our IT go-to gal. <laughs> she might be able to do a screen share and show you like <laughs> I'm afraid it'll open a wormhole if I share my screen. Um, yeah, right. There. I wonder if oh, so Jessica on on her picture, she just you yeah, yeah. And she didn't have the wormhole opened. <laughs> we can't see it now, Jessica. Uh, there. Okay, I'm gonna jump off of here. I just thought I'd give it a try. Thank you. I appreciate mm -hmm. it. We'll get there. Um, don't, nobody needs to stress. We're all, we have an hour and a half, so we got time to exhaust all the, yeah, I can, I could call you, Carol, worst case scenario, and then we can um, maybe talk through it if my brain will cooperate. Carol, can you exit out and come back in? So Hit the button that says leave. And then, so when you come back in, hit the blue button again. Then that white box comes up and it's going to, like it shows you your picture and apply. There's two little drop boxes in there and you have to make sure your microphone and camera are both showing in those two little drop down boxes before you click apply. That's what Jessica was trying to show. I think I can hear you just a little bit, Carol. Could it be a volume issue, Stacy? Let me turn mine way up. Unless there's people talking in your background, that might be what I'm hearing. Yeah, it could be the TV in the background. Okay. Um, okay. 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 Let me get back out of here. Let me try. Let me try screen sharing here. Okay. So when you, when you click on your own picture and that you click on that cog, does it show your microphone and your camera in those two boxes? I went right here to this little wheel after I clicked on your picture. I do have your number, Carol, if you want me to call you, but I don't want to like if you don't have your phone nearby, I don't want to throw another thing into the mix. I will get my phone. She says it's okay, Mary. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> I can read okay sign language. <laughs> I'm just going to use my home phone in case I need. 
to do something on my regular phone. Thanks for bearing with us, everybody. Um, Darcy is saying maybe you have to log all the way out and back in because they had this exact same issue. Okay. I'm gonna Hi, Carol. <laughs> Look how techy she is. She knows how to work technology. She's got a headset. <laughs> Would the headset cl click into the you computer? Could plug, you could plug the heads. Do you have a laptop or a tablet? Because you could plug your headset into your device. Because you got a microphone right there in front of your face. There should be a port. If it's a computer, you should have a port that's pink, maybe, that the microphone plugs into. Sometimes it's on the front, but it may be on the back. So, Stacy, tell me what you want me to suggest. Um, somebody just said you could put Carol on speakerphone. Uh, yeah, I could do that. I'm afraid we'll get a whole lot of reverb. I can try it. Do we want to have Carol log completely out of hop in and come back? Be okay to try that, Carol. <laughs> That's why we love you. <laughs> Thank you. We'll stand by. Oh, also, when you do log back in, be sure that you're enabling audio and video because it'll ask for that. Okay. Okay. Great. She's so patient. Bless her heart. Um, go <laughs> up to the top where it says leave. Yeah. Yeah. Or you can close out the whole, you can close out your whole internet. You can go back to your email and click that link again and try that if you'd like. Yeah. I guess I could have turned my light on. I hear it too. I think it might be Stacy's background or someone in her. Check out my crab pants. Can you see them? <laughs> well, you're already in the session, so close that tab and then open a new one and you, we should all go away. You shouldn't be able to see us anymore at that time. Up at the top where the X is. Yeah. While they're troubleshooting, I'll bring up the website we have built uh, around Carol. So you can look at pictures until we get her connected. So um, you are hearing me, Carol, because I'm coming back through your video. So if you can go up there and at the top, hit the X, we'll all go away. Go back to your email and try from the beginning. I think that might help, but I'll still be on the phone with you. Exactly. Perfect. You're gone. You're gone from the screen, but we're still on the phone. So that's perfect. Um, now go back. Do you, do you need her to, I think that's the best. Yeah. She's going to, 
Stacy, she's going to click on the link that I sent her in the email, which should open a new tab. I would have right. her go ahead and unplug the headset since you had this working once before. The headset is how we're talking on the phone. Oh, okay. I thought she plugged it into the computer. Okay. Tell me what you see. Do you see a chat down the right? This is what I do every day for work. Perfect. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Do you see us, Stacy and me, and the pictures of Jonathan? Mary, is she on a tablet or an actual computer? She's on an actual computer and she can hear you now, Stacy. Making progress. <laughs> so you should be able to do like you did before. Ask to join that blue button that you clicked at the top of Stacy, right above where Stacy shows. Oh, okay. Perfect. Yes. Okay. And then you should get a window that shows you. Do you see yourself? Okay, perfect. Below that, there should be options. And you want the one that says um, full webcam or something like that. What do you think, Paul? I, you want, let me ask Stacy. One says HD true microphone or sorry, true vision camera. And the other says microphone. Um, Which should she click? Try the one in the camera because that would be the microphone that's in the webcam. Yeah. So try the one that says camera. You have to click it twice. You have to click. Okay. Please. Yes. I think it's going to work. Can you guys hear her? No. If you take the port out of your phone, you won't hear me, but there might be a a port on your computer that you can plug it in. I think that'll work. Exactly, just the um, connector at the end of the cord. Whatever looks like a headphone cord, I'm not sure what that would be. The microphone in is usually a pink colored circle and the headphones are green. But your headphones might work because it's it's both headphone and microphone. Mm -hmm. Do you have something near the USB port? Or does, uh, does she have desktop speakers and potentially there's a headset port on the front of her speakers? Yeah, I think it's the audio jack, yeah. We were, I know we made it work really well. So possibly she could go back out and choose the other microphone that was listed. Cause there was another one listed, right? Hmm. 
Stacy, would you say it? If you have, uh, first of all, do you have speakers that have a port on the front of them for headphones? Um, okay, tell you what, I'm going to put you on speakerphone and we'll just see if my mic will pick that up. I could kind of hear her earlier through your phone. A lot of feedback. Yeah, too much feedback. I don't think that's going to work. There's just too much feedback. Carol, you could try to leave again and in the drop down box, switch to the other can other microphone that was listed. The one that didn't say true cam hd try the one that just said microphone or if there's one that's labeled default make sure you're using that one okay you're gone <laughs> some days i hate technology <laughs> you and me both. Carol's agreeing with you. <laughs> I do this for a living and some days I just hate it. <laughs> it can be so frustrating. You're coming. I see you coming. This time, just try audio and see what happens. I think your video might pick up anyway and yet we'll have audio. Uh, correct. Sorry. Um, it's when you join and you have to enable, which you've already done because I can see you. Um, so go to the settings right beside where you see the microphone. It looks like a flower. Click on that. And then if it says default microphone, click on that and then apply. Maybe this is what we did last time to make it work. And if the red line is still through the other microphone, you'll need to get rid of the red line. Perfect. Oh, no, that's good. You want that. But it's not through the microphone. OK. Uh, click on the microphone, maybe see what happens. Yeah, we'll take that off because we don't want that. We know that. Any other ideas, Stacy? Not really. Because I don't know if it's her or if it's the software. Is it hop in or is it is it her computer? I have one more thought for you, Carol. Um, look at where you you are in your picture, and there should be a microphone in the right, top right of the picture of you. Okay, yeah, that's right. Yours is on the screen. Well, I can mute Carol and Stacy. So now you and I are talking. Now you still hear me. Let me mute my Okay, so one more thing to try. 
plug your headset back into your telephone. Can you say something, Stacy? Something, Stacy. Has Carol ever done a Zoom chat? No. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, you can still see yourself. Okay. Perfect. All right. So open the internet again. We'll just, we'll just try it from the beginning. However you were logging in to hop in, we're not going to use the link I sent you in the email. We're going to start because you were doing really well in the hop in commenting. So, Go log in to hop in however you were doing that before before we tried this today. And take your time. We're, you're good. We're all patient, happily waiting. It's worth it. You're worth it. Um, well, okay, yeah, do that. Do that. <laughs> Are, is, do you have the internet open? Okay, so start to type in your in where the you know where the URL shows up. Start to type in hop in, and whatever auto fills. Okay, uh, click on that and see what happens. Yes, log in. No, don't want to create an account. Just log in, which is. Yep, perfect. Um, that should enter. Yay, yay. All right. So if you go to, we're getting there. We're getting there. <laughs> so go to the um, main stage where we were watching everything, you know, the, the link on the left that takes you to the stage. Okay, then click on um, sessions down the down the left side. Do you see where it says reception stage sessions? Okay. Try that. 
Yeah, let's see what that gives you. Perfect. And those sessions, it should say meet Carol Ann. Awesome. Click on that. Uh, try it. I'm not sure. Yeah. And tell me when you see me and state me on the phone to you and Stacy holding up. A <laughs> okay. What does it say after live? Click on that, the now over sessions. And there should be two li listed there. Okay, tell me what you see. Click on that. That's perfect. That's that's where you want to be. And this time when it oh, I hear myself <laughs> twice. No. Anything, Stacy, you can think of? We've tried. I, I wouldn't know how to walk her through checking to see if her microphone is muted, but I can't imagine how it would have gotten muted because you guys just did this and it worked. Yeah, I, I can't believe that she was in changing settings and somehow muted her microphone. I can hear her fine through the phone, but the problem is in order for you all to hear me, we get an echo. Echo, yeah. Well, why doesn't she just go and get Jonathan and bring him on camera and we'll just look at him? There he is. <laughs> she said he's got a nut in his hands. Oh, he does. <laughs> and of course, I've got my camera is like right in front of my. <laughs> Hi, John. Hi, John. <laughs> yeah, Booking or something? Kind of relay through through Mary the best that we can. You'll have to be our interpreter. <laughs> oh, look. What a big boy. Yeah, we can see great. We can see great. 
He's so calm. <laughs> so I know that Carol got John and Kate and one other crab in 1976 on the Jersey boardwalk. Pretty sure it was Jersey. And uh, Kate Ocean survived City, 30 yes. Ocean City, Maryland. Okay. Um, and Kate survived 38 years. The other one died pretty early on, if I have my history right. And then we still have John, 44 years with Carol. Crab Hayes, she had, um, who was too tiny. That was your first, one of your first crabs? Wow. Oh. <laughs> yeah, seeing the shells, that has a, that's, that's crazy. Wow. <laughs> He died mysteriously while he was molting. She looked under a rock. His body was there, but his shell was out from under the rock, so she doesn't know what happened. Mm -hmm. There was no digging as if he'd been attacked by anyone. John's shell opening is big. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's where he gets his name from, is the book, Jonathan Livingston Siegel. She said 1970, that book was on the cover of Time Magazine because it was so popular. I really need to find the book. I love books anyway. You see this tiny little shell? Mm -hmm. That's the shell Jonathan came in. 1976. So he probably was like a couple years old, roughly, when she got him. Crab Kate was in that shell, so she was bigger. They have grown up in every kind of shell. They mostly grew up in pink murex shells. I got to drop off for a second. I'll be right back. Bye, Stacy. Wow. <laughs> he tr for for everyone else, he tried that on and walked around the living room, but didn't keep it. Wow, Vanessa sent that one from Australia. He never wore that one. <laughs> Wasn't quite right. Only Jonathan knows. She has she has a bunch of big shells from Mike Vukoder that he keeps supplying her with and giant Jonathan isn't isn't taking, but they're there. <laughs> that one is from Tammy Wyke from her uh, store that Carol got personally. Wasn't that incredible? It was incredible.
One of the fortunate things that Carol had was a sunken living room where she lived, where the crabs could roam. Her crabs have always run around the living room because there were two steps in that sunken living room and she could they couldn't get out. So they had this giant area to roam. Uh, yeah. She said that's a picture of one chasing the other. Oh yeah, and there's the steps. Did they ever fight, Carol? They loved that tree in their tank and Kate was the boss. <laughs> if Jonathan was on the top of that piece of wood, uh, Kate would come up and peel his toes off one at a time until he fell off so she could be on top. Because Carol's crabs ran around in the living room, she never used sand in her tanks, ever. She's the only person in the world. Is that fine gravel? Whoops. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> she said, Jonathan, pick those up, please. <laughs> He, he molts in this very fine gravel that she's showing you. Um, she can't even find it anymore. If I'm correct, Carol, he molts on top of it though, right? Not under? Oh, he digs under, okay. He's in a tub. That's the, that's the lid of the tub that he molts in. She puts that piece of slate over one end of the bin where the gravel is. She holds that up above that gravel with glasses. So you have to make a little cave. Is that right, Carol? Okay. I was just checking to see if people could hear. Sorry. <laughs> Is it better, Stacy, if I if I hold that? Okay, so they can hear you if I hold you up to the microphone. So I'm just going to let you talk, Carol. That's awesome. Go for it. Gravel that's in there, which is gravel, moist, and then I 
and I watch the humidity. I don't even need, I don't even need those gauges. I can tell by my hand how humid it is. But I have gauges.
where he likes to sit all the time. And I wash it and clean it, and that's why it takes me two hours to clean a tank because of all that gravel. And I see somebody saying that the heat, somebody else may be yes. How do you remember that he ate the Emma sausage? Yes, I just bought a can.
That's adorable. You're young. water. 
water from his dish out here. When he walks around, look at those eyes. Can you see him? Oh. <laughs> Hi, Jonathan. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, no, you can tell. It's pretty acidic, I think. He gave us a lot of pictures regularly in uh, Land Hermit Crab Owner Society.
Yes, you do. We need you. Thank you for the mask, by the way, Carol. It's fantastic. Mary. I did. Sorry, I've been so busy. I love it. That's perfect. <laughs> Wow. Huge. Oh. That's amazing. <laughs> you have fans all over the world, Carol. Nice. <laughs> he does. Does he vocalize, Carol? Yeah. 
Carol got all the uh, CrabCon swag too, so Jonathan's been eating from all the vendors. Oh, yes, he's having a wonderful time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Does he eat paper? I've heard he eats paper. Sherry said, never trust him to take the mail to the post office. <laughs> Can't argue with that. Do you know about when he was lost? No, tell us that. You know, he's not easy to find all the time. And maybe December last year, I lost him. I couldn't find him anywhere. I looked under every piece of furniture. I keep the bedroom door shut so that he doesn't go in there. Because I have a lot of medical newsletters my dresser and he likes that paper too. He chews a lot of those medical newsletters. But um so I always keep that door shut and um uh, pretty soon I had told my friends or by email, pretty soon they were showing up. They didn't even tell me they were coming. They just came over here. That simple one came with big flashlights and everything. Jonathan and everyone was absolutely sure that he or she was going to find this crab. <laughs> these 
He was watching over you. I bet you've been doing that a lot over the years. <laughs> he found you. That's funny. We had a little tiny baby escape from the tank and, and um, make its way all the way to the top of our carpeted stairs. My husband came to me with it on his hand and said, I think this is yours. <laughs> That works well. His favorite rock. That is quite a picture. Somebody take a screenshot of that. I don't have enough hands. <laughs> he's hungry. That's good that he's eating now. I think we are. If there's something else you want to say, we're, we're all ears. Um, I just don't want to tax you too much. I don't know if our session ends immediately at 4.30 or when the activity stops, but I just wanted to be sure we uh, we had a we had an idea that it might end at 4:30. Okay. Well, just you did amazing. We made it work. Oh, how fun. And uh, funny little books here, you know? Yep. <laughs> we should make a children's book, Adventures with Jonathan Livingston Crab, and all the crazy things he's done. Stacy. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> my shoulder is <laughs> I'm gonna need Ben Gay tonight. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> I love it. It's nifty. You look real techy too. <laughs> well, my mom's 83 and she couldn't have done what you just did. So there you go. <laughs> I think he's a good repository. I'm going to come back on quickly just to talk to you, Carol, but uh, that will mean people won't hear you as well. I just wanted to give you a personal thank you. <laughs> she loves us all, she says. <laughs> the phone down so I don't hear myself twice. Thank you, Carol. Um, I'm sorry this was so awkward, um, but I, I'm proud of us. We made it work. Just shows you what crabby people can do when they put their minds to it. Um, you're awesome. You're a huge inspiration. Um, you know, you get mentioned more than you have any idea in, in our various forums, you and Jonathan, and um, we're just so grateful. We, we would love to have you on Lycos, but you'd have to join Facebook. We would love that so much. <laughs> she sees you, Mike. I'll put it back up if you want to say goodbye to everybody, but I just wanted to be sure I took the opportunity to... Thank you, thank you, thank you. I like it. He looks like a Bubba. Thank you, Carol. <laughs> we would do this anytime that uh, we could just to see you guys. Let's. Carol said she's watched every single thing. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, nobody wants to say goodbye. <laughs> I think they meant a screenshot. They were trying to get a picture of you um, in the Zoom, you know, like in this in this uh, uh, video meeting. I think someone must have gotten one. Yeah, Vanessa got a screenshot. So we somebody will share it with you, and we'll share it widely. And you were our guest star, you and Jonathan. <laughs> 
Uh, yeah, I gotta, re I gotta repeat that because they didn't hear it. She said, "After Tammy, there's no way to compete," which I agree. <laughs> yeah, but that that video of the oh my god, the microscope is just incredible. <laughs> that was smart. I can send you the link so you can watch it anytime you want. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> Go us. <laughs> she says we're a riot. All right, I'll, I'm sorry, I'll hold it up one more time. You can say goodbye, and then I will go away until everybody's done with their goodbyes. But thank you. You can still type. Yep, absolutely. That can go on as long as you want. Thank you, Carol. Say it again. Thank you, Stacey. And everyone else. All right, I'm going to leave.